Okay guys, what's up? Let's see. I'm going to start playing The Walking Dead. And so what we're going to do is we're going to play through the whole thing, then do 400 days, and then do uh, uh, Season 2, which right now, as of this recording session, is only up to Episode 1. I've actually played through the whole thing already, but I was going to start over because I can't remember what file I was actually using. So, when I was playing through before, like, up to Season 2, um, I had lost track, and it basically said that I didn't have any files um, that I had completed the first season on. Which um, is only true because, I guess, the, the computer... I think the computer got formatted or something. The um, All the stuff that we had before, we had to basically reboot the computer completely and you know start things from scratch and so what i just found out was that like it stored the walking dead um season one stuff in the cloud on steam which was weird but i went with it but i still couldn't figure out which file i was using <laughs> some of the decisions that i was looking at didn't quite add up so i was going to go ahead and try and play it over again on my own so here we go we're going to play this one is the least for, um, far along, so we're going to delete it. It's kind of sad. That probably was a file I was using. I don't know. And we are going to go right in. Well, something went wrong, and it screwed up. As soon as I clicked play, it froze the game or something. I don't know what happened. Anyway, let's do standard because I feel like I'd be a lost idiot if I didn't play standard. So let's start from the beginning. Because I don't want this game to make decisions for me. See, that's the, that's the draw of the game. That's why I had to do it this way. See, it adapts to the choices you make. I would rather them be my own choices because that makes it a very unique experience. Assuming I act differently from other people. Which I could. But, since this thing is starting to act up, maybe I should shut up. Title sequence. Maybe I won't. I don't know. We'll just have to see. What's kind of a bummer is that since I've already played, I kind of already see the stuff coming. I might not remember everything, but I probably remember most things. I'm ruining the ambience of this, and I know it. <laughs> I'm not even trying well, to. I reckon you didn't do it, Dan. Oh, goody. This is where I come in. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Why, Why do you, do you say, say that? that? You know, I've driven a okay, bunch I'm not going to talk in sync with him. Prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get to, I didn't do it. And what do you say? And what do you say? I say, yep, I know you didn't. He just repeated himself. I forced him to repeat himself. Excellent. Ooh, I get to look around and do things, kind of. I'm in the back seat of a cop car. Oh, rear view mirror. Awesome. I followed your case a little bit. You being a making boy and all. Bacon. You're from making then. Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. I always <laughs> wanted to work a murder case. Is he on a 70s like cop show? That senatorial show? mess you got yourself mixed up in. With all due respect. No a due respect. Shame, that is. Why is he going that way? The whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. See, the interesting thing about this is, depending on what you pick, you could get backstory on certain things that are going to pop up later. So that's really kind of cool. Some, like, stuff that I haven't even noticed before. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on a six year. Well, it's on, it's on hold. <laughs> and this is what he picks up on, obviously. You want to know how I see it? I... I got much choice. choice. Sure don't. <laughs> oh. Mad face. Regardless, 
could be you just married the wrong woman. <laughs> he wants to say something, but he just grunts. He's related to Tim the Tool Man Taylor. See, if you listen, you kind of get what's going on, I guess. Or at least you know something's up. Helicopter? Really? See? Lead in. Lots of unfinished words from me. That's I'm driving this man once. He, he was the worst one. Oh, he boy. wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella. Big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you're sitting. I hope that's not supposed to make him feel better. <laughs> and before because long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. And I'll tell him he's got to stop. But that's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. Zap so him stops, with a laser gun. Having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. <laughs> See, he's a lunatic. So did he do it? They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife. I don't think that response is any different. Came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. Mm -hmm. It goes to show, people up and go mad when they believe their life is over. Oh, I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit Oh, I see it. I see it. Oh, shit. This other time. You have no time. It doesn't give you. Yow. Okay. Wake up. Wake up. He's so sleepy. Uh, oh, shit. Thirsty. Ah. Ooh. Fuck, my leg. If you want to, maybe not right now. Okay. Hey! Hey, officer! Are you alright? So he's looking I'm over still here. Cuffed back here. But the guy's over there. What? I guess he just. Why the hell did he have his gun out? Why are you looking over there and noticing something on the other side? Kill it! Kill it! Freedom. And two. Okay, right. So to get used to controls. They changed a little bit of the inf interface in uh, season two, I noticed. It's still basically the same, but I don't know. I, I think they just changed the look of it more than anything. Dang. So pretty much throughout the entire series, I'm pretty sure Lee bleeds out and falls over the whole time. As much as you'd expect a hero figure to. Let me see if I remember moving fast. No, I don't. Okay. It doesn't happen here. Officer? Okay. Da -da -da. Shit. Yes. Come on, you're fine. Yes. Nothing is going to happen. Trust me. And click the lock. Officer. He became very self-aware just Holy then. Shit. What in the hell? <laughs> yes, we're up against the car. Get 
assisting. Come on, grab! Uh, of course you did that. Awesome. Don't make me do this! Do you really think you have a choice? There he is. He's got a nice view from the inside of his skull now. Man. Not even. His skin's all rotten and he smells like shit. What the hell is this? <gasps> Silhouette! Help! Go get someone! There's been a shooting! Already lying. Well, technically not, I guess. There has been a shooting, it's just not being specific. He's lying by withholding information. Yeah, trip on the inside of the guy's skull. Good stuff. So, let's go. I feel like that should have been a part of the action, but eh. You know, I throw you into too much, I guess. You know, other than shooting the guy's head off. Hello? Anybody? There's nobody here. I'd fill one of those teacups with some bourbon if I could. Very odd way of approaching this. Let's jump in the pool. No, we're gonna... Whoa. That was cool. Let's do this. Help! Yes. I wonder if anybody's home. Mm, maybe. I just swear there was some Hello? way to run. Maybe not yet. But eventually I think you get to run. Uh-huh. Well then. That was useless. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? I think he's already got a pretty good idea of what the world is like already. Which is interesting. Ah! Hello? I'm not an intruder. I just broke into someone's house, One of but them. I'm not an intruder. These people might need more help than I do. So let's help them. Unicorns. Signs of danger. It's a fairly obvious sign, too. Oh, crap. I had to slip on the blood. Excellent. We're slipping on blood. And ransacking the house. Right, let's do that. Oh, that's dumb. We're not gonna do that. We're gonna, yeah, that's the one. That is the single thing, yes. So let's take it. Excellent. And what's that? Cup of water. Yes. <sighs> and maybe there's something on there. Well, there's a lot of buttons on it. Three new messages.
messages. Oh, yeah. Message one, left at 5.43 p.m. Hey, Sandra, this is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Dad had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message two, Aww. left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and calls aren't telling dropped. us anything about Atlanta. Oh, please, no. please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Marietta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message three, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby. If you can hear this, oh. call the police. Whoa, that That's was weird. Nine what did I do? We love you. We love you. We love you. Love you what? What did they mean? Daddy? Huh? Yep, that's me. Hello? You need to be quiet. Yes, listen to her. She knows. Who is this? <laughs> I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Hi Terry. Clementine. She I'm lives me. in the walls. That's You're how she not knows. my daddy. No, I'm not. <laughs> Would you like me to be? I don't know if that's possible. Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Oh, nice Where TV. the boats are? Where are you? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. <laughs> Very weird tone to this. Whoa! What a nose! That's right. Why? Well, don't, like, break your leg with your arm. There we go. Hmm. That was fun. Man. Hi there. What a circumstance. Did you kill it? I think something else did. Before me, I think. I heard her scream two nights ago. Maybe one of the monsters got her. Who is two she? nights ago? Yeah. That's probably what happened. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. Yeah, they've been playing this prank on her for think too that long. might be a little while, you know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. Oh. What should we do now? We need to get out of this neighborhood. It's not safe. We're less likely to be seen if we move Oh, at night. not that. My parents might come home. We won't go far. We'll try to find shelter and come back here with others. Wait, that sounds what? good. Did I seriously just pick the... We can hide in my treehouse the... until then. Wait till night. It'll be a tough climb with this leg, but... I didn't even... Okay, maybe I should idea. read things more clearly. <laughs> because that's not what I was going to go Stay for. Stay close to me. So please don't... Yep, okay. Alright. 
this was not the method I wanted to go with, but okay. Now let's stay quiet. We'll head out to the front yard and follow the road out of the neighborhood. Okay. Sure, sure. It'll be okay. Stay near me, and we'll move as fast as we can. Okay, guys, I think that's it for now. That's pretty good, right? So, anyway. It's a pretty interesting start. I didn't quite want to do this. I actually wanted to leave earlier. But this will work for now. So, we are gonna push forward some other time. Alright, thanks for watching.